Juniper Green is a village on the outskirts of Edinburgh, Scotland, situated 9 km southwest of the city centre. It bridges the city bypass, and extends along the foothills of the Pentlands. It is bordered by Colinton to the east and Curry to the southwest. It centres on Lanark Road, the main road leading out southwest of Edinburgh into the central borders. The village stands on an elevated ridge above the water of Leith to its south. Administratively, Juniper Green falls within the jurisdiction of the City of Edinburgh Council having been officially absorbed into the city in 1920. History Juniper Green's earliest mention is in the Kirk records of Colinton in 1707. However, it is largely called Karimurend up until the end of the 18th century and the area only really developed as a village from around 1810. Indeed Adair's map published in 1735 shows no sign of the village, nor does Laurie's more accurate map of 1766. Only one house in the village Gawanli, appears to predate 1810. Traditionally, its major industries were paper and snuff set in the river valley of the water of Leith. Only with the building of the Balerno Line with a railway station in Juniper Green did the village begin to prosper. Its closure in 1955 redistanced the village from the city centre. The 300th anniversary of Juniper Green was celebrated throughout 2007 and the community supported many social and environmental improvement projects. The opportunity was also taken to record locals' reminiscences about Juniper Green and collect photographs, which have been archived on the Juniper Green Village Association website. <laughs> <laughs> Buildings Juniper Green Parish Church, formerly the Free Church built 1879, by James Graham Fairley. Topic. Education Juniper Green is served by Juniper Green Primary School designed in 1910 by John Alexander Carfrey and nearby Curry High School. Topic. Culture and attractions Today Juniper Green it is primarily a dormitory suburb of Edinburgh with its own shops, including, a bike repair centre, an opticians, a chemist, two pubs, a fish and chip shop, an Italian restaurant, as well as a large selection of hairdressers. Leisure facilities include a golf course, bowling club and tennis club 6. The area is served by Juniper Green Parish Church. Topic. Local newspaper The Curry and Balerno News is Juniper Green's community newspaper which also includes coverage of nearby Balerno, Baberton and Curry. Published monthly the paper features local news, a monthly police neighborhood watch update, an SSPCA appeal and coverage of local planning applications and developments. Topic. Transport The A70 runs through the area and Juniper Green is served by the 44, 45 and 44N bus routes, which are operated by Lothian buses. It also has access to Livingston through Blue Bus Service 24 funded by West Lothian Council. The 33 bus service is also available via a connecting footpath to Baberton Mains. Topic. Juniper Green Community Council The Juniper Green Community Council was inaugurated in November 2009. Topic. Juniper Green Conservation Area Juniper Green Conservation Area is situated 7 miles to the west of Edinburgh around the main Lanark Road. 
The conservation area is centered on the historic core of the village of Juniper Green, one of a number of villages, which have been absorbed into the city of Edinburgh. A recognizable village character still remains and the conservation area status was originally designated on 19 November 1993 to protect that character. The boundary was extended in March 2007. Conservation appraisal Topic. Famous residents Thomas Carlyle rented the house, Mount Pleasant, at 502, Lanark Road. David Henry New Zealand industrialist and philanthropist was born here. Edwin G. Lucas surrealist artist. Willie Merrilies (1898–1984), at one time Scotland's most famous policeman. James Murray (d.1634), one of the first men in Scotland to be called an architect. Michael Woodruff (d.2001) performed the first kidney transplant in the United Kingdom. Former professor of surgery at the University of Edinburgh. 